Yo, 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 what it is? The twin. It's the twin. Back at the G battery shit again, man. Still in effect. Shit point no swapping. LS2 shit. Yeah. I got more video, but I'm gonna start y'all in the middle of the swap, man. You know, I had a lot of shit going on. And on top of that, this would be my first time doing an old vlog on this YouTube shit. So, I done kind of got all the good shit out the way, man. I got the motor installed, all that. That's in there. Oh, it's, I'm pretty sure it's a thousand videos out here. Nigga showing you how to install a LS in a G battery. But, what I'm going to show y'all today is this fuse system. Yeah. You see it? We got the brand new fuel tank. It's for uh, 87 Grand National. Fuel inject this motherfucker. Now this don't come with it now. In my sending unit. Uh uh. -uh. Be careful. You can get these online or you can go to your local auto parts store and get this. This is a FG156A Spectrum sending unit for Grand National 3.8. Fuel injected shot. Return lines set up. That's what you need. Other thing, uh, that pack touched down today. Yeah, we got some shit now. We got some things to make this thing got to do what it's supposed to do. So here we go. Y'all gonna be the first I show. Package this shit. Let's see what we got, y'all. Let's see what some of them brought the cap. Oh, they packaged this shit up real nice. They're too dark, but y'all, we got them put in a better position. There we go. See what sounded on brothers. Santa brought the kid. Hey, let's show shit. Yeah. Ah, damn. I did some good package work on this time. Don't be getting a sneak peep in this. Okay, okay, okay. We got here. We got the braided line. Braided lines. Oh, I'm sure this is a regulator kit right here. But then the braided line that come with it. It's the universal radio uh universal regulator kit. Come with the fittings. All your fittings, air yeah, fit, nine degree fit. Bracket to mount you got, yeah. Well, lady. Shit. Sorry about that, y'all. I ain't got no props. Making do what we got. Got your pressure gauge. Zero to a hundred, real quick. Yeah. Let me put that back in the box. Oh, let's see what else coming in a bit. Mm, 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 mm. Let's swap over. Okay. 
Okay, y'all, here we go. And we got <clears throat> the regulator. Yeah, I went with this style. I could have got the old, uh, what it is, C3 Corvette regulator. Go up on the bottom of all that, but I've been hearing a little back and forth issue about something on them. They ain't really working, and you know, I don't know. Sometimes they don't work. Some of them do, but the one that don't work. It ain't pushing the right pressure fuel to your uh, fuel rails, and this shit ain't gonna crank. You ain't got the right pressure going to it. I think it's like 58 pounds of pressure for the shoot up through that motherfucker. But I went with this style, universal adjustable, you know, turn them up the way I want it to be, you know what I'm saying? So I know it getting 58. You did. Damn. We ain't done, we ain't done, we ain't done, we ain't done. Yeah, man, Amazon came through, man. I've been waiting on them. Two day process, you know what I'm saying? Normally longer than that, they came on through. Okay. Air motor. You know, I know what that is. All the real LS swappers, y'all know what's going on. Air motor fuel pump. Oh, it go in the tank. Sersky. Come with your little rubber garment for the protection and a little protective garment to go around it. Uh, here we is. Air motor. This motor go in the tank. <clears throat> this will hook up to your fuse sending unit. All the little parts and everything that go to it. Give you rubber holes, clamps. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I know a little something. I know a little something. We ain't done yet. Let's see what else. Let's see what else got them. Amasana umbrellas. Oh yeah, I forgot that the filter that go on. Catch all that dirt. Young dirt. Get the prop back man. Bam. All right, we ain't done yet, we ain't done yet. Here we go again. You got the ammo sound of them bottles. We been spending some money. We <laughs> been spending some money. Only thing about it though, you go in LA, anything that say Vortec on it. Shit ain't cheap. Yeah. Okay, okay. Here we got 25 foot EFI fuel holes. You're gonna need that. You're gonna need some tough shit. Like, I don't think you can just go to AutoZone and get that little bullshit. Oh, Lord! A good win. Yeah, but don't think you can go to AutoZone. I think you just finna go get that old fuel line they got back there on the rail, back there behind the uh, commercial counter. I had a pot to try that shit once. 58 pounds of pressure. Shit will bust right through that son of a bitch. Pressure bust pipe. So we got this braided fuel line, 25 feet of it. You know, we ain't gonna use the whole 25 feet. You know. Got to modify it yourself. I don't know how long your car is or what your application is that you're working on, but you're gonna need this right here. It got to be. The tough stuff. If it ain't tough, <laughs> it ain't enough. Oh, what this is? Uh oh, let's see. I'm not sure what this is. Let's find out. Okay. <clears throat> you got to have this, Jack. Fuel filter. Catch all that dirty dirt, dirty dirt dirt come up through there. Fuel filter. And this air motor too, I believe. I got the name on it. Might be the out brand version of it. But, come with the holster, you know, the mountain bracket, should I say. Oh, okay, you got to adjust it right there. Once it open up, it just slide on over there. 
Uh, come with the fittings, clamps and shit. Yup. <clears throat> and I believe that's it for the Santa gifts, man. So, you know what I mean? But, them some of the things you're gonna need to do an LS squat. You know, fuel line, filter, fuel pump, air motor, uh, that's gasoline the E85, you know, I'm probably run both either way. I don't know what I'm feeling when I get ready to hit it. Uh, brrr. What is that? Oh, my sending unit. For uh, 87. Grand National. Got to have that. And a regulator to regulate that pressure that, it, that that pump gonna push. I think that pump push like a hundred. 100 and some PSI, so I got to regulate it down to 58. That way, it'll have a smooth, cool ride. When I get ready to do my tune, everything will be boom. <laughs> All right, y'all. Oh, shit. Next thing next now, shit, gotta put this shit together. You know what I'm saying? Get back with y'all on that. Y'all stay tuned for the next one. Yup. Yeah. Cap. Exposed custom. Get at me.